Oh my god, could you be any more embarrassing? Listen, mate, just go back to wherever you're from and leave my daughter alone, okay? I'm Mark's brother. Mark Gillen? I'm his little brother Elliot. They must have talked about me. Go home, Nicole. What? No, not when it's time to Nicole, just do as I ask and go home, please. What are you doing here? I want to know how my brother died. I've heard what the inquiry said, now I want the real story. And I want to hear it from you. I know that every little brother probably says it, but Mark was my hero. Yeah, he talked about you all the time. Did he? Oh, Mark was a pain. He, he drove us all mad. He, he really did talk about you all the time. Well, he must have made stuff up, because I've never done anything that was a big deal. So, um... Why now? Why are you here? I think you can work that out. Yeah, it's been almost two years. See, I knew you'd get it. Mark's anniversary is just a few days away. My brother died, and yet you and all the other guys in your unit all made it out. How'd that happen? I know you're aware of the story, but if it helps, I'll go over it again. That's what I'm here for. We were ambushed by a group of soldiers. We came under intense fire. We were heavily outnumbered, and that allowed the enemy to separate us. We had a contingency plan, a designated rendezvous point. So for the next 20 minutes, we straggled over to it, and I was the last to arrive. Second last? Yeah, the second last. We waited an extra 10 minutes for Mark, but he didn't show. So you just left him to fend for himself? The enemy were everywhere, Elliot. And the longer we stayed, the more dangerous the situation became. Mark could have been dead, and probably was. So I made the decision to pull out. I wasn't going to risk my entire unit going back looking for him. Yeah, I know that part. I didn't like doing what I had to do, Elliot. But I did it. Just like the inquiry concluded. That's right. And you have to know that if Mark was in my position, he would have done exactly the same thing. So why'd you get out of the army? Well, the SAS, it's, it's all or nothing. And after what happened, losing my best mate, I decided it was time to get out. So I did. I did write a letter to your family, you know. Yes. Mark was a brave soldier. And he was an even better friend. He was a good brother, too. Thanks for talking to me. I, I just needed to hear it from you. Yeah, well, you know, if you need anything, 